Just to give Hello right, bags, video. it's Jade back once more with another reveal from the Genesis Extra Life live stream going on right now. Go and give them some support. The links will be in the description box down below and the links for you to go donate. We are getting our first look proper at the guided missile. Lots of you guys told me about this being the case when they showed the Mysterious Mysteries a few weeks ago. They said it was going to be some sort of tech missile launcher and it looks like it is the case. So I want to talk over this one a little bit more. Definitely not as OP as you think. It's going to be guided. You're going to be able to guide where it goes, but it does start ramping up speed. But there are some limitations to it. Here's the dev to talk about the limitations to it. There Ooh. we go. Tech remote guided missile. My apologies. <laughs> this, um, this, is a, this is a cruise missile that is a shoulder-fired missile. Um, as soon as the player launches it, they get to watch the missile go out and expand out. Uh, into its full missile size shape. And then uh, they assume control of the missile from its, its viewpoint and can direct it to wherever its target is. Um, it'll, once it hits something, that'll create an explosion or you can actually remotely trigger it too early if you want for, for whatever reason. Um, you're also not forced to stay in the missile. You can jump out and let it continue just going on its path straight from where it left. Um, and it does quite a bit of damage, but it is a one-time use rocket launcher. As soon as you use it, it's gone. Um, very similar to like a javelin type missile, but you're just remote guiding it in after that. Uh, it does get a lot harder to control after, at, over time. It starts to speed up. Uh, and then the missile itself can be painted on, it can be written on. Um, you can. You can use these to send messages uh, oh, man. with your gift of a missile to oh, whoever you're sending that anticipate to. anticipate some of these messages. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and that, oh, man. <laughs> um, and then at the really cool part, and this is the, the, the beauty of it, is after you've hit, it'll do a nice little pan out so you can see the carnage. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Of what you've done. Yeah. Um, which can't be skipped if you don't want to watch that or things are a little hot at the moment. Mm. You know, you're in some heavy PvP action. Um, this is going to be cool. It's going to be fun. It looks like that trailer or that, you know, not trailer, but the teaser for it looks Oh yeah. pretty cool. Yeah. It's uh, pretty quick. And if you didn't notice, there was a little bit of highlight around the pteranodons. Mm -hmm. Might have a little bit of assisted visuals to help you get to your target uh, more accurately. But it's not a, it's not a fat, it's not a mobile thing. Gotcha. It is a missile. Gotcha, yeah. Um, so you, gotta, think some you, gotta, you gotta plan some things out yeah. before you're gonna hit something. Because I could see someone being concerned that it's very agile and you're able to, you know, swing around and move around. Yeah, you're not flying thing. it into a base okay. and around the base. Gotcha. gotcha. That would be a very difficult yeah. thing to do. Gotcha. That's good to know and that's good and feedback to give to people because I can already see people cringing when they see that video like, oh. Yeah, you can go and play <laughs> the video again. Just remember to mute the music. That's yeah, yeah, mute the yeah, but this is amazing. Oh, now you unmuted, I believe. Wait, no, he's right. Yeah, cool. yeah he's good. He's good. It's smart. Cool, smart. Man. Let him do his thing. Yeah. The design of it looks cool too. Mm -hmm. Just the actual model, yeah, man. The that UI looks of it, the design. cool. I this like was, it. This was clever. This is cool. This is fun. This, this is gonna be. I know a lot of people were saying PVE devs, PVE devs, and. Hopefully this isn't too scary for the PvP side of things, because rockets are strong, they're, they're very effective. Uh, explosion damage is, is, is a very serious thing in our game. Yeah. It, it has a lot of impact. Um, so this is going to be a big PvP item. Uh, it's still pretty much locked down by turrets. Turrets you know, control the, the skies as far as projectiles are concerned. Um, so it's not going to have an easy time getting through those types of barriers, but an open war, open war PvP, or once you've gotten uh, those turrets uh, run out of bullets, or you've tanked them enough, uh, however you've managed to get in to get their generators through whatever means you you use, our players get pretty creative. Um, so there we go guys let me know what you think about the reveal so far we've seen two creatures we've seen a base item we've seen now a new weapon what else are we going to see are we going to hopefully see the tech airship or catamaran or hydrofoil or hovercraft whatever we think that might be i hope so i will definitely be going to sleep now i ended up getting back up because i just could not sleep to show you this guys I'll catch you for a roundup of everything that's gone on. Make sure you're locked in on my channel. Laters, ratbags.